Come in. It was dirt nasty. I freaked out. It was it, to make a big comeback. And yeah, he's super solid. He's very textbook. Very. Uh, I'm gonna dash dance. I'm gonna swing, and I'm gonna kill you if you're a spacey. Well, you know that makes sense, and I think that's how you really should approach the game as Marth. I mean, I think of all characters. Oh, oh my just goodness! Down there with the back we're, here. we're talking about Edge Luke McNichols. Like, uh, I'm sorry, guys, but I'm playing Doctor Mario, and I'm I'm taking him to the I'm taking him to the doctor right now. I respect any Mario player oh, who yeah. does well against a Marth, especially. I mean, oh, this yeah. this matchup is so hard. Actually, it took me a couple a couple weeks to get the uh, the canceled up B. You know the the one where you actually don't go anywhere. Oh yeah, the up B cancel. The up B cancel. It took me forever just, to learn it. Just a little side note. It does say one O, oh, even though we didn't witness the first game. I'm not too sure. Don't worry, it's still O O. But All we'll right. get that fixed. Yeah. But taking the stock, bring it down to three apiece. I'm actually. I love seeing a good dog. I love. It's just not something you see often anymore. I mean, oh, after yeah. the, after those older years of. Oh yeah. Of you it's know a less dawn. developed meta. Yeah. The meta has evolved so much. Oh just my! As a second stock, gosh. you took it just a falling back I here. I love, I love these drop zone bears to call out the up bees. It's crazy, and it, it's looking like he's throwing it out at a time where it will cover like certain sweet spots. So it's very interesting. Dash tag. Oh man, Edge Luca. Ed, yeah, it's okay. Uh, Edge Luca, um, just kind of dropping the juggle here. You know, Nickel, Doctor Mario doesn't really have that great options coming on the way down, so if you can just kind of juggle them a little bit. You know, it's it's really... Oh! Oh, okay, we're nutting, we're nutting. Oh, hit that nut button. Hit. We got a four-month sub, a four-month sub. There we go. We got a, we got some subbies. Anyways. Thank you so much. Oh, but in this match, wow. Oh, my gosh, that traded so unfortunate for Edge Luca. <gasps> my wow. God. And he did it. What he, was that? He, he doesn't have to... It's really interesting how, as Doc, he, just a Mario in general, he's getting so close to Edge what Luca. What was that? And all of his edge guarding has been so on point. Seriously, it's been insane. I that was like I was watching Sheik, like it was like needle into needle <laughs> into like gravel edge. Pill, 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 pill. Yeah, get your vitamins. Marth having a little bit of deficiency. Make it, Nickel kind of making sure that he's, he's, he's healthy. He's scared to even get down. I mean, yeah. I mean, honestly, as Falcon going against a Mario, I know I can just space with Nair and, and all that, but Edge Luca, I, he's finding himself to be a little lost. Oh, but fairing against the pills. Oh my gosh, great spot dodge. Just winning the classic RPS grab hit, you know, spot dodge situation there. Edge Luca has to be super conservative with the stock here. Definitely. Uh, gotta abuse that range. You gotta make sure that you can't take any hits here. Oh, a little bit scary. Wow, he's not getting, he's unable to get, oh, there he gets a strong hit. But, oh, charging the Nair, charging the Nair, coming yeah. down with that hard hit. Oh, and no jump, yeah. No, no, What's been that was 151%. Yeah. That is really high. Uh, definitely, that's, uh, if I could Stating live to that obvious. age, that'd be pretty nice. <laughs> Man, he is playing, it's like I'm watching Mars versus Ices right now. Uh, and he's using those pills to space a lot. And I think he's saving. He might be saying it for. Oh, oh, but we have a cover here. <gasps> Missing that downer, it. How did that miss? He's a little Side bit, a little bit floaty, a little floaty. Waiting. So he couldn't get the dare on top of him. Wow, this is so much percent in such a short amount of time. Yeah, 109 percent already. Oh, but charging oh, the dare. Yeah, F smash was a little bit too slow from Edge Luca. Nickel just making sure to get those pills in, getting his solid percent in. He wants to get under him. He wants to get under him. Yeah. Up till not gonna kill. Man, this is so close. Oh my. Oh, down there gets him right there. And the first game at 121 percent and one stock left. Nickel takes the first game. I'm, I'm shocked that Edge Luca went for an F smash there. You know, I felt I like that was such a uh, that option. <laughs> it was definitely all or nothing, but I felt like. There was a little bit lower uh, committal options for that, but sometimes you just got to throw your S-Mash in the air. Look, Doc, he's got short little legs. That's true. Tiny little legs. Marlon's huge sword. But he takes that first game, and you know, I can see on Nikhil's face, this is stressful. Oh, yeah, this he's not, he's not out, of the, out of the force yet. It's like that one scene in Get Out when he, the guy just runs. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> he, he's, he's still running. Here on Pokemon Stadium. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I have to nut because we just got gifted six subs. Six whole subs. 12 nuts. Wow. 12 nuts. 12 we got nuts. six more nuts. Uh, just so many. 
macadamia, walnuts. It's at, we got all different kinds of brands right now. Maybe salted, unsalted if you're if you're that type of person. I prefer salted. Can I be honest? <laughs> I prefer salted. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. But uh, while we were getting hype about those uh, those subs, Nichols already lost one stock. Oh, I love the fox shot right there. Looking a little bit like some ultimate. But yeah, some in this matchup, <laughs> looking like ultimate just came out. You know, this is the ultimate now. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Wave dash great. in, fair, uh, yeah. forward smash, taking that stock right there at 125 percent. This yeah, right now, hard. it's honestly, this this is starting to look like what I expect out of what I would, you know, imagine a lot of uh, using the sword to abuse Mr. Dr. Mario's uh, short little limbs, making sure to outspace everything. Not Nothing too committal. You don't have to commit too hard. Sometimes I like to say that if you are in a matchup where you can pretty much relatively win neutral for free and get solid percent, you know, sometimes you don't have to go for big punishes, and we, it's being shown right now. We see Edge Luka not really going for big commits. Yeah. It, it really is just like and watching the, Marth versus Icy. Yeah, and the thing is, not too many characters have projectiles in the game, so uh, when you do have a projectile, it's really, you know, vital that you use that. So Edge Luka's understanding, you got to be able to swipe those pills out of the air. And, but Nikhil's using that, that kind of lag of swiping on the pills to try and get under him. That's the whole game plan. And... You know, the biggest issue is how do I get close with Dr. Mario? Oh, yeah. A really common tactic. I haven't seen him use it yet, but it's doing a full hop pill, but wave dashing or wave landing yeah. in. He's been kind of, it, uh, it's kind of like um, for all my uh, classic FGC people, it's kind of like Guile when, he, when they choose to do the slow sonic boom and then walk behind it. It's kind of like a wall, and then you get to, you know, play around wow. it. Wow, you so heard the sick. up B come out right there. Up till great DI, though. Oh, no, no jump. Yeah, you just got to keep juggling him, right? Pretty much. I mean, I, you can't do too many too many hard hits on him, especially when he's out uh, out on the side of the stage. But, you know, Nagel's probably going to understand uh, maybe something he's got to improve on because if he loses this, he's got at least one more game on yeah, he still he still has one game though. Yeah, we, we all got to remember that adaptations. You know, humans do have brains. Of last course, time I checked. Of course. Um, so he definitely can try to adapt here, but man, it, it it's an uphill battle at 62%. I think the biggest adaptation that came out from Edge Luka was swiping the pills in a very uh, relatively safe manner, not putting himself too out there. You know, very opposite of like you know most guys at the club. Of course, very yeah. conservative. Very conservative. Very conservative. I like it. You when know, that game two, with separate two, <laughs> two separate beds. Two separate beds. Staying separate. Um, so winning that game with two stocks, one to one. One more game left for these guys in pool, uh, in pools. Uh, let's see where Nickel takes them. I mean, I'm betting maybe somewhere small like Yoshi. I mean, we, we don't see the ban. Yeah. He probably doesn't want a huge space like Dreamland. A fountain. F F o I, I think this yep. makes a lot of sense. It's this either does. Yoshi's or FOD, right? You want to get that small stage. He probably banned Yoshi's. Uh, yeah, yeah. Probably. So this oh, is the best bet, man. but you know, this is so hard. Getting up from the ledge as dog, such a difficult task. Yeah, okay, well, he has center and loses it quickly because, man, when you, Marth, that platform height looked pretty in favor of Marth. You can just run up and fair and just cover pretty much half the center stage, right? He's basically, with this matchup as dog, you're banking on your opponent going a little bit mind numb, kind of yeah, a little bit on too the aggro. Pills, little, yeah. And you really have to plan your, your entrances because like we just saw there, you go in a little bit too gung-ho, and then the sword comes at you right on your oh, head. Yeah. If there was blood and gore in this game, best believe this fountain would be red. Yeah, right now, I honestly think that Dr. Mario is kind of looking like Glenn and Martha's uh, Negan right now. <laughs> it's a little rough. Doc look, kind of looks like he has his hands tied behind his back right now with how little range uh, he has compared to Marth. Yeah. And right there, uh, what Nihil could have instead of done, uh, going for the down B to get close to the ledge, he could have reached for one of those far extended ledge grabs from the up B. Uh, instead, he ended up losing the stock because he couldn't reach the ledge. Oh, oh my gosh, wow. is this Captain Falcon? <laughs> what was, oh, like, but oh, the Mar fair to fair to fair. Great in though, not falling off the stage. What an interesting down smash. Oh, he tries to cape it, but trying the to catch the sword. Oh yeah, that's oh, the yeah. one thing you gotta watch out for if you're recovering with Mars. Is the sword will go through the stage. Oh, uh, oh my gosh, Edge Luca, you're cool. You're you know, cool, taunting you know, on him. You know what? <laughs> Do you really? Did he really? 
Yeah, sometimes you just got to press up on the D-pad. Or we don't know. Maybe he has a hidden Arduino. <laughs> one, <I don't> know. <laughs> automatic, you know, pulling automatic. A, Pulling out, what's it called? Uh, <laughs> Incineroar. I just, yeah. If you're far ahead, you just immediately uh, taunt. Taking one stock, you know, yeah, yeah. that's at least something. Yeah. When you're low percent and they're high percent, you know, CC down smash, it's all good. <laughs> Everyone be looking for that CC down smash, but. Taking it right there with bringing the KB4. It back. Yeah, bringing it back to 2000, like what, six with the Ken combo? You know, it's unfortunate, but. He played really well, especially in that first the game. The first game. 